Hello everyone, it's me, Lars, the Corporate Blue Fit Manager of Tui Blue. Today I prepared a resistance band workout here in Tui Blue Nam Hoi An. The training will be focused on the upper body. And here on the water sports station, everything is prepared. Come on and let's start. Okay, so first of all, I want to show you how to grab the terror band. Very often in my classes, I can see that my participants grab the terror bands like this. But of course, it's completely wrong because with the nails, they can cut the terror band if it starts to stretch. And that's why it's really important take the terror band around your hand, and that's all. Okay? Also, here's the same only turn it around and then you can work without to grab. Uh, and also, if the intensity starts to be too low, you can open the terabend, or if you need more intensity, you can close the terabend. Uh. First, we start with an easy exercise. Roll the terabend around your lower arm, so we have a great distance to work now. <sighs> Fix your shoulder or your elbows here next to the hip. The shoulders should be fixed back and down. And also to keep a straight position, bend your knees a little bit and bring tension in your lower belly. Okay. Now, we can pulse a little bit. That's all. Take care that we have a 90 degree in our, in our elbow. And we, we pulse fast. Okay. I think 10, 10 seconds more should be enough. Breathe in, breathe out. Five seconds more. Okay, good, great, and relax. Good. The same now. We um, have an outside tension. Pull with your arms outside and straight your arms forward. And now in this position also here, take care about your shoulders. Take care about the tension in your belly and we start to swing again. Pulse. Okay. Focus only on yourself. Take care about your shoulders, don't break out. And 10 seconds more. Okay, it starts to burn, I think. Five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Okay. Relax. Let's continue with the rotation exercise for our spine. Yeah, we want to have the same, exactly the same position. Bended knee. Take care that you will push out the knees a little bit for the outside tension yeah, to stabilize the pelvis. Then also here, tilt the pelvis four up. Maybe you can take a look to our um, stability ball movie because over there we explained how to tilt the pelvis, okay? Great. Shoulders back and down. And slowly we start to rotate to one side. Slowly we come back. Rotate to the other side. That's great. And I hope you can see that my knees are completely fixed. It means my knee don't move, don't leave the position. Every time I push my knees outside. Okay. That's good. And now we can start to be a little bit faster. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. One time more. Okay, and relax. Now we will continue with the next exercise in exactly the same position. No? Push your knees outside, stabilize your pelvis, tilt forward. And now we work diagonal. So it means we start from the left side, but down, and we lift up our arms to the right side, above the head. And then we go back. 
down, left. And right, above the head. Down, above the head. That's good. Choose your own speed, like you feel comfortable. Also here, it should be free of pain. If you feel pain, work more slowly or don't rotate too much. Uh -huh. Then you should limit your move. Otherwise, use the full range of motion. That's great. That's good. Two times more. Uh -huh. And the last one. And relax. And maybe you have watched correctly to me and you have seen that also my follow, my nose or my eyes are follow the terabat. This is important. Uh, don't make some things like this because also we want to have a rotation in our neck. So the other side now, we start down on the right side and we lift up our hands to the left side above the head. We go down again and up. Down and up. Down and up. And every time with my hands, I pull outside. So my shoulders have always a tension. And two times more. Okay, now we continue with the next exercise. The name is Chopper. Here important now is the focus uh, lays on the move downwards. We came from upstairs, or from upstairs we came from um, above the head and we, we move really fast down and suddenly we try to stop. We go up and we stop. Take care that your body is stable. Yeah? Please don't lose the tension in your body. Outside, stay straight. That's great. Okay, same on the other side now. We start from the left side above the head and we lead the terror band down to the right side and stop. One time more. Okay. If you have done it right, maybe you will feel that your muscles start to be really hard. Okay, and that's why. Relax your legs, relax the shoulders and your arms. We continue with the chopper, but now we move with our legs. In the first position, you can see my foot is turned and the heel is up, has left the ground. Then we go down and deep. Opa. Okay, in this position, we have to stop again. I stretch the body and down. Ah, okay. And up and down. And up and down. And you can see, yeah, um, in reason of the stop, your, my body starts to, uh, to be disbalanced. And that's why focus and stop. That's good. That's good. And stop, okay. If you use your balance, it's not a problem. This is exactly this what we want because first, when you lose the balance, all the muscles starts to work together to keep the balance. So it means it's a learning process for, for the muscles. Okay, other, um, the other side. Also here we stretch the right arm, the right side, until the heel. We go down and suddenly we stop, okay? 
Ah, okay, good. That's nice. That's good. Uh, two times more. And the last one. Okay, good, great. And relax. So, now we can open our band. Relax your shoulders. We want to stretch a little bit between also that our body can come down. If you want, you can use your TerraBand double. Lift up your hands above the head and bend by side. My left arm, try to move as much as possible in this direction. My right arm pulls down. It means my muscle is stretched, but the reason of changing of this tension here, the muscle has to work much more. But push. If you do it correct, you will feel the difference of the tension in your muscles. Five seconds more. And relax, okay. The same on the other side, yeah? Also here, lift up your hands above the head, bend to the left side, so it means our right arm is on the top. The right hand, try to move in this direction as much as possible. And with my left arm, I start to pull slowly, but strong. And this arm, this side, this muscle, has to stabilize. Please don't swing. Don't do this, okay? Be calm, keep the position. And with my left arm, I spend the impact in my muscles. Okay. And five seconds more. Three, two, one, and zero. Okay, good. Relax. So, nice. Um, I want to show you an exercise for the lower spine, or in this case, it's more for the, for the whole spine, the muscles next to the spine. Um, bend your knees, bend your body forward, but don't bend uh, your spine. Yeah, the spine is straight. And our view is around uh, 45 degree, or let me say, one and a half meter in front, in front of me. That's good. So, like I said before, choose your own intensity. No? And lift up your hands up and down. So we pulse up and down. Straight your arms. Try to fix your scapula together. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 4, uh, 5, my mistake. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Okay. For the next exercise, you should open your, your TerraBand a little bit more because now we work forward next to our head. It's a little bit more intensive. Okay, good. Take care that the knees are bended a little bit. Feel the tension in your lower back. Fix your shoulders back and down. Lift up your hands and we start to pulse. Okay. Breathe in, breathe out. Keep your arms parallel. And the last 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 
five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, and relax. Of course, you can repeat this exercise in three rounds or five rounds like you want. But we will continue with the next exercise because I want to show you uh, a high variation. Okay. We will go down uh, in the push-up plank. Yeah, the push-up plank is nice. If your hands are parallel or shouldered, you can see my TerraBand is relaxed. Not like this, huh? it's relaxed. The hands are shouldered. So, if you have problems or pain in your hand wrist, you can do it also in the plank position, or you can use to stand on the fist. I prefer, I prefer, I prefer this variation. Okay, good, nice. Here, take care about the tension in your belly. Also here. And now we start to rotate up and we come back. We rotate with the same arm and we come back. And the same side again. And one time more. Okay. Relax a little bit. I will change my side. You can keep this position, but I will change my side so you can also follow my moves. And we do exactly the same exercise, but on the other side. Okay. Keep the tension in the whole body and rotate up and down. Rotate out and rotate in. Out and in. Out and in. That's nice. Two times more. Keep the tension. Okay, and we relax again. So let me show you the last exercise. Um, we have a long step forward. So also here now, we have a stretch effect. We will go down and we repeat exactly the same exercise. But wait, I will start with this side for you. Um, my left leg is forward. So my left arm rotates up and down. Out rotation, in rotation. Out, in, out, in, out, and in. Three times more. And the last time. Okay. You can change the leg. I will change my position for you. Now, the right, the right foot is forward. Straight the other leg. Right leg. It means the right arm is moving. Rotate and back. Rotate. And back. And as you feel, we do it slowly. The body has time to adapt. We don't need to rush. And the last three times. And the last one. Okay, perfect. Whew. So, this was a nice training 
with our resistance band, in this case, the Terra band. I hope you have enjoyed the session and you sweat a little bit like me. Yes, and for more videos, please like, subscribe and comment. See you later, bye bye.